washes over our beautiful South Florida home. Well over two million of us live, work, and play here. Who are we? We're the citizens of Miami-Dade County. Miami, Florida, the 305, home of Trick Daddy, Trina, JT, Young Miami, Flo Rider, and many more. People think it's sweet coming from where we're from. But little do they know, it's a whole nine yards we gotta go. Hold on. In this documentary, we're going to interview some Miami natives who's been alive for 17 years to 60 years. First off, we got the house of Gilda Alma Nose slash Lynn, where she's going to talk about her life growing up in the 60s, moving to Miami and her culture and being from where she's from. Okay, where are you from? Miami, Florida. Any part? Opalaka. <laughs> Okay, so how was it growing up in Miami, Florida, in the Opelika section? Back in the 60s, it was nice. Everybody knew each other. You get in trouble, everybody, mom in the neighborhood, and you get in trouble to take you home to your mama. You got two beatings, one from the neighbor and one from your mama. It was good growing up in Opelika. What is one memory you got of growing up in Opelika? I have a lot of memories, but the one I like most is when, you know, we used to play outside. But when that porch light come on, you better be in the door. We played outside, we played kickball, we played hopscotch. And we had fun growing up. We had a lot of games we played together, you know, but you know, it's, it's changed as the years went by. Opelika made a great change. At six, a mother grieving both her children. They drove away after the shooting and Bayard ran back. One day after a fatal shooting at an intersection in Opel Mourning the death of a woman wounded in a highway shooting. The violence in Miami is absurd. People die every day here. Kids, elderly, teenagers. But... As a community, we still stick through it. Next interview, we interview an Overtown resident herself. Okay, so where are you from? Miami. Which part? Overtown. What was the best part about growing up in Overtown? We used to go in the pool, go to Gibson and Williams. Like, is there? We run around the hood all day. Like, what do you say that Miami have that's like different from any other city? The people, the place, we are, we completely different from anybody. Our shit look different, the people different, like, we talk different. What about the culture? The culture, yeah, it's different. <laughs> what would you say, like, being in Miami taught you, like, living in Miami for these past couple of years taught you? I survived. I go anywhere else I can survive, because Miami is intense. You gotta know how to survive here, you're gonna get eaten alive. So I don't know how to survive. 